Hello everyone, welcome back with Revit Basic Tutorials, how to edit keynote text. Okay, and here for example, I will create a simple room with uh, walls. The next, if you want to insert keynote into this uh, Revit software, you can go into another uh, tab and you can click keynote in here. I will use a user keynote and I will click at this point. You can move into here. You can click close. The next, you can go to edit types, and in here we have uh, two options for show in uh, this keynote. First, you can show for keynote value, and the second, you can show for keynote text. In here, for leader head, I will uh, set like into row 30 degree. You can click apply. So the keynote will be changed with arrows, and you can click OK. Now, how to edit text in uh, this keynote, you can go or create new schedules. Okay, you can go into view, and here I will click for schedules, schedule quantities. For category, you can set into the tile items. You can uh, click in here, schedule keys. Okay, in here I will set into keynote. You can click OK. Now you can insert comment in here. So we have uh, this for value, and this is for text. You can click OK. Just uh, like for example, I will insert new rows. Okay, I will set two rows. For the first, with uh, text, I will set into room, room one. And for second text, we can set into room two. Okay. Now you can click files, go to export. And you can click reports and click schedule. In here you can set into text and for file name I will set into example keynote with text. You can click save in here. Click OK. Now you can go to level zero in here. And you can click annotate. Go to Keynotes and click Keynote Settings. Click Close and you can click Browse. Search for your text in here. I will save, uh, save in um, Documents. And we use uh, this text, example Keynotes with text. Click Open. OK. And you can click OK again. So if you double click in uh, this uh, Keynote, it will be show for Key File 1 and Key File 2, like you can set in it room once, click OK, so to be changed into room once for text, and this is for value. You also can hide, like this values, and you can click OK, so it'll be show room one. You can add again keynote, okay, you can click here, and I will use a uh, user keynote, you can click at this point, and you can uh, set like into room two, click OK, so to be show for room two. Okay, that's it, how to edit keynote text in Revit. And if you have any question about this tutorial, you can comment below this video.